Hi there, people of YouTube. So, just recently I bought a 3DS, and maybe a month ago or two ago, I bought this other one, and then I tried fixing it. It actually worked, so I continued and bought this one. This one's still not fixed, but I'm still uh, learning at least to troubleshoot it. But today I went out and took some time to look for another one, hoping that I got some cheap games out of it. And yes, today I bought this uh, Batman Arkham Origins Blackgate. I actually wanted this game, that's why I bought it. And <clears throat> the person that sold it to me sold it for $5, which uh, I seen some sort of cheap other prices like 10, 15. But um, this was a this was a kid, so actually, actually he wanted to sell it really bad, and I wanted it too, so might as well. I bought it. I'm not really sure how much it is. I need I need to check the actual price. But my plan is to play it and then sell it again, or keep it if I really like it. And by his little brother or the younger one, I guess, had Splinter Cell 3D. And he actually also wanted to get rid of it. And I didn't really want to buy it. But they said they'll give me a deal if I <clears throat> if I buy this and a 3DS. And because I told them that I want to fix, I want to learn how to fix 3DSs. And they actually brought it out. And I said, okay, I, at first I thought it was a regular 3DS. But then they brought this guy out. And this is the XL 3DS. And this is the older version. And I actually want to have them all at some point. So maybe I was kind of losing hope already because these were kind of expensive for a while. And then the 2DS is pricey too. So I don't know if I'm going to buy it. If I find a cheap 2DS like for 30 or 20 bucks, that would be great. But I, I haven't found anything actually. Um, I seen them for sixty plus taxes, but other than that, it's the cheapest. And this one actually came with um, well, what they they sold me was basically everything you see here, the games, the two games, the the 3ds XL plus the charger, and there is a memory. Let's see, there's a memory card in here. I guess it's the one that it came with and it's I'm not sure I don't think it's the one that it came with but it's a four gigabyte memory card <clears throat> yeah and it doesn't have the stylus and it's a broken 3ds so I don't know if I actually got a deal I'm hoping that I did but I paid twenty dollars for for both of these games and these games are actually the the cases are in really bad condition. You know, they were they were actually played with, so people open them and toss them around. Shit. So another one to open. All right, but the game's in there. I just wanted to show you that the game's in there. Something's up with this. Didn't want to open. All right, and then I got the charger. And I actually need a charger, so, and it's the original. Wait, I don't even know if it's the original. It doesn't say Nintendo, so. Cause my other charger that's Nintendo is different. This one looks like a, like a Chinese version one probably, but it feels, feels like good quality though. Oh yeah, it is actually. It's a Nintendo charger. So I, I don't know if it if it came with it. Maybe it's one of the first ones that came out. I thought they said Nintendo somewhere over here. But I don't know. So that's basically what I got. Memory card, 3DS, charger, and then two games. So from what I know, this charger is like... I think it's like nine or ten dollars new used. I would say five dollars. This card, I don't know. 
maybe like five dollars new and then the 3ds i have no idea how much it's worth because it's broken if the screens work that's that's like another twenty dollars if uh this works i didn't test this one i only tested the batman black gate so hopefully this one works so i don't know how much that one is but this one is like 19 something bucks new and then it's like 10 15 used uh, so I, that's why i bought it because it looked cheap and that's pretty much it uh, i'm just saying that you can go find some deals on these games and then on the 3ds if you uh, are willing to put in some work and this one actually has the charger the charger seems to work so I'm not sure, but I'm going to open it up and see what's up. And then first I'm going to open it up because they said that their parent or somebody opened it up and then it did, they couldn't fix it. They told me the story behind it that they said that this was going bad so, and then it just didn't work. And then the, the guy that was um, the owner, I kind of like pushed it too hard, I guess, or something. And then they broke it off. So, and that's why this is broken. So basically they broke it to try and fix it. I don't know. They they look like they didn't know much about electronics. So I'm assuming that that it still works. Uh, the cameras look like they, they're fine. The box, the case I mean, is fine. It's missing a stylus. And then the, the charging port looks looks decent. Uh, the buttons are not broken either, and none of these uh, sliders are broken. So if not, I could just uh, get rid of the parts. Hopefully it works though. All right, so that's pretty much it for this video. Again, um, please uh, dislike, subscribe, or, or like, uh, comment, and see. Um, check out my other videos. All right, thank you. Bye-bye.